daily reading for today Tuesday January 14th 2020 the first reading is from the first book of Samuel chapter 1 verse 1 to verse 9 to 20 Hannah rose after a meal at Shiloh and presented herself before the Lord at the time Eli the priest was sitting in a chair near the doorpost of the Lord's temple in her bitterness she prayed to the Lord weeping copiously and she made a vow promising O Lord of hosts if you look with pity on the misery of your handmaid if you remember me and do not forget me, if you give your handmaid a male child, I will give him to the Lord for as long as he lives. Neither wine nor liquor shall he drink, shall he drink, and no razor shall ever touch his head. As she remained long at prayer before the Lord, Ella watched her mouth. For Hannah was praying silently, though her lips were moving. Her voice could not be heard. Eli, thinking her drunk, said to her, How long will you make a drunken show of yourself? Zopper up from your wine. It isn't that, my lord, Hannah answered. I am an happy woman. I have had neither wine nor liquor. I was only pouring out my troubles to the Lord. Do not think your handmaid and never do well. My prayer has been prompted by my deep sorrow and misery. Well, I said, go in peace and may the God of Israel grant you what you have asked of him. She replied, Think kindly of your maid servant, and left. She went to her quarters, ate and drunk with her husband, and no longer appeared downcast. Early the next morning, they worshipped before the Lord, and then returned to their home in Ramah. When Elkanah had relations with his wife Hannah, the Lord remembered her. She conceived, and at the end of her term bore a son whom she called Samuel, since she had asked the Lord of him. The Word of the Lord Responsorial Son, let our response be. My heart exalts in the Lord my Savior. My heart exalts in the Lord, my horn is exalted in my God. I have swallowed up my enemies, I rejoice in my victory. Response My heart exalts in the Lord, my Savior. The bows of the mighty are broken, while the torturing gird are in strength. The well fed hire themselves out for bread. While the hungry batten on spoil, the barren wife bears seven sons, while the mother of many languishes. Response My heart exalts in the Lord, my Savior. The Lord puts to death and gives life. He casts down to the nether world. He raises up again. The Lord makes poor and makes rich. Her humbles. He also exalts responds my heart exalts in the Lord my Savior he raises the needy from the dust from the dung heap he lifts up the poor to seat them with not nobles and make a glorious throne their heritage responds my heart exalts in the Lord my Savior Acclamation. Alleluia, Alleluia. Receive the word of God, not 
as the word of men, but as it truly is, the word of God. Alleluia, alleluia. The Gospel of the Lord is from the book of Mark, chapter 1, verse 21 to 28. Jesus came to Capernaum with his followers, and on the Sabbath he entered the synagogue and taught. The people were astonished at his teaching, for he taught them as one having authority and not as the scribes. In their synagogue was a man with an unclean spirit. He cried out, What have you to do with us, Jesus of Nazareth? Have you come to destroy us? I know who you are, the Holy One of God. Jesus rebuked him and said, Quiet, come out of him. The unclean spirit convulsed him, and with a loud cry came out of him. All were amazed and asked one another, What is this? A new teaching with authority. He commands even the unclean spirits, and they obey him. His fame spread everywhere throughout the whole region of Galilee. the Holy Gospel of the Lord, Jesus Christ.